The National Democratic Congress Constituency Executives Conference will afford the party an opportunity to elect new leaders who will man the affairs of the party at the constituency level for the next four years. Candidates ahead of the polls have been caught in the support of delegates who have the voting power to elect the next crop of executives. Eric Agbanyon has been leading the constituency as a general secretary for 12 years and he is seeking re-election. He tells me his good work will win him more votes come October 22. As the constituency secretary, you know, my department is in charge of making sure that we keep records of all activities or things that are, has happened in the, cons, in the constituency. First of all, we have uh, during my tenure, we, I, I and my deputy or my team, we have uh, what is there, we've created a database okay, for all party members in the constituency. So we have the youth, the aged, and what have you. I mean, that database is there, which, I mean, anytime we need somebody, we can easily go to the database and we fetch the record of such person. It's same with Yusuf Ahmed Abagli, who is the incumbent Zongo Caucus coordinator. He believes when retained, he can rally more youth to vote the NDC into power come 2024 elections. 2024 election, there is no matter my Experience is the best teacher. A new broom sweeps clean, but the old brooms knows all the corners. And for so doing, we know how to go about things in the constituency, being that we work as a team. And uh, that frustration, the result is, I mean, we are result oriented. It is the result that matters. It is not uh, who has been there for long. If you have been there for long and uh, you yield a result, a better results. Ali Asman Suleiman is switching roles from an electoral member to contest the deputy treasurer position in Ayawa's North constituency. He has been briefing the news team on the reason for his contest. Ever since I was elected into office, I more or less have done so well for the party I have within every everything that is supposed to be done as a, a, a executive member i did it and once there is a position that is available within the district i think i feel it's more looking at i am from within i feel it's more i should be able to contest for it so that informed my decision on that meanwhile the candidates are uncertain whether the polls will be held following rumors of an injunction suit filed by one babata hiru who has been suspended from contesting the chairmanship race once you put an injunction okay you 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 you, you insert some level of what uh, what the frustration it's because someone will pick a car and has to come to their grounds and vote somebody has traveled and has to what? I mean, I mean, come back and vote and go back. Somebody has to go to work, okay? Has to come to the ground, vote before going to work. All these things, I mean, the person has prepared his mind that this is the way I'm going to go about it. However, in an earlier press conference held on Thursday, the chairman for the Greater Accra branch of the NDC, Adekoka, was confident of resolving all electoral concerns to ensure a smooth election. Constituents of the Ayawasu North area are unsure whether or not the constituency elections by the NDC would also be conducted in their area and this follows an injunction that was sought by one of the candidates who is seeking to lead the party as the chairman at the constituency level. Reporting for City News, my name is Kweku Edu